I screwed every guy in this organization, literally and figuratively, and I gave the shaft to every woman who stood in my way. Now, at 28, I am the youngest editor Gloss Magazine has ever had. Or any woman's magazine, I think. Ask me if I'm happy. Are you happy? Deliriously. <laughs> Today, that is. Yesterday, I was miserable. And I might be miserable again tomorrow. Who knows? It's crazy. Yeah. Put him on hold. This has turned into one of my busiest days, and we've got so much to talk over. January, I'm really <laughs> glad to see you. <laughs> Why don't we have dinner tomorrow night? Oh, I have a date with David Milford. David Milford? He's the biggest stud in town. How did you manage it so soon? Well, he's my dad's wife's cousin. Of course. Otherwise, you'd be on the waiting list. I said, put him on hold. You said on the phone yesterday you'd like to model. Or act. Right. Well, I called this agency, and they're looking for a fresh face for a commercial. I've got the name of the agency, who to see, the address, all that jazz. Now, you know what I want from you? What? I'd love to get a story on Deidre and your father. Now, I have tried and tried, but she always turns us down. It's all here. Don't forget to tell them I sent you. Thank you, Linda. Listen, I love it. Okay, what line's he on? Right. January, I want you to call me. I want to hear all about your date with David Milford. Everything. Take notes. Hello, Bruce. You want to know something? You're a shit or a reasonable facsimile. <laughs> <laughs>